to enable.org presents Mathematical Literacy Data Handling Summarizing Data Data Measures Exercise J's Memo Right, let's quickly go to the handout. We are going to look at Exercise J, the answers thereof. Please don't look at this video. Watch this video before you've done this exercise. Otherwise, you do not get a lot of advantage from it. It is better to then just watch a music video for the uh, during the time that you spend watching this math literacy video. Right, uh, you have to use the data and do a frequency table. You have to write the numbers in ascending order. You have to calculate the mean, median, mode and range. Right, so now the data, number one is about the number of pets. Number two, the percentages obtained. Number three, the height in millimeters of trees. And number four, the wages of farm workers. Right, so now here you have to round the numbers to different. Uh, question one, round to the nearest whole number. Question two, round to the nearest whole number. Question three, round to one decimal. And lastly, round to the nearest 10 rand. Now let's quickly look at those answers. Right, here we have all the uh, data. If we first do a frequency table, we get there are three uh, households with three pets, four households with four pets, eight households with five pets, six households with six pets and nine households with seven pets. The mean, add all the values together, three plus three plus three plus four plus four plus four plus four plus five plus five plus five, five etc. is 164. We divide that by the amount of data points which is 30 and we get 5,46 because this is discrete data. It equals to 5 pets. The median is the two values in the middle. I've circled it already. So that's 5 plus 6 divided by 2. It gives us 5.5, which is 6 pets. Now remember, 5 plus 6 is 11. And 11 divided by 2 is 5,5, which runs to 6. But if you just punch into your calculator 5 plus 6 divided by 2, you'll get 5 plus 3 which is 8 and 8 is not even in a set of data. 7 is the largest number so please be careful how you do this calculation. The mode is the value that occurs most often so that would be the 7 and the range is the largest value minus the smallest value which is 4. Uh, question number 2 the marks. Uh, now we're going to do it in class intervals, summarize in, in class intervals. So between 10 and 19 there are 6 values. Between 20 and 29 there are 10 values. Between 30 and 39 there are 10 values. Between 40 and 49 4 values. Between 50 and 59 7 values. Between 60 and 69 5 values. Between 70 and 79 2 values. And between 80 and 89 1 value. Right, so if we add all these values together to get the exact mean, it's 1,803 divided by 45 gives us 40,06%. The median is 30, uh, 36, the middle value is 36. Um, it's in fact, ooh, I think this 36. The mode, because not all the values occur twice. There are quite a number of modes. It's 12, 23, 28, 29, 34, 35, 36, 49, 54, 63 and 64. But now this mode doesn't describe the data very well so therefore we can just as well say there are no mode because the mode is to predict a trend and because there are so many different trends, we just we can just as well say no mode. Right? Um, but in an exam, there will be a clear mode or no mode at all. Right? So all of the values will just occur one, once, like yesterday's lesson number four. The range is the largest value minus the smallest value, 81 minus 11. So the range is 70. Okay, the height of the trees, if we do a frequent, 
a tally uh, frequency table with class intervals 0 to 0, 9, 1 to 1, 9, 2 to 2, 9, 3 to 3, 9, 4 to 4, 9, 5 to 5, 9, and 6 to 6, 9. We get these frequencies 1, 2, 6, 4, 6, 5, 3. These are the, this is the data from small to big ascending order. If we add the values together to calculate the mean, we, we get 105,6 divided by the 27 data points is 3,9 meters. The median, the value in the middle, is 4,0. 4, uh, there, there, there the middle value is. The mode is 2,1, 3,8, and 6,8. And this is a better... Um, data measure this mode because there are only three values and the range is the largest value which is 6,9 minus the smallest value which is 0,9 and the range is therefore 6 and lastly the wages this is the tally table two of, of occurrences in the uh, extremities between 0 and 999 between 1000 and 1999 is 2 between 2000 and 2999 is 5 between 3000 and 300 3999 is 6 between 4000 and 4999 is 2 and between 5000 and 5999 is 1 this is the data from small to big. If I add all the values, I get 50,790. If I divide by 80, 18, I get 2,821. And remember, the question, the instruction said, round to the nearest 10 rand. So this is 2,820 rand is the nearest 10 rand. The median is uh, 3,000 plus 2,600. If I divide that by 2, I get 2,800. The mode, the value that occurs most often is 2,500, 2,500. And the range is 5,600 minus 450 gives me 5,150. Now let's quickly look at the handout again. For tomorrow, could you please do Exercise K, the data measures about Jackson, and then I'll go over it again. Right, please do it, otherwise it is a complete waste of time. Sorry, and previous one. Thank you very much. The resource is developed by toenable.org.